Hello YouTube! I am Pinstar and this is Pinstar Plays Merchant of the Skies episode 6? I think 6. So in our last episode we restored the uh, the hands, the, the, uh, the mysterious hands, um, and found out where batteries come from. Uh, I also um, extended the poll to uh, uh, see what ship we get next, since they had not bought one yet. And uh, despite my pleadings for uh, uh, the Orumbai, the Carrick remains the number one choice. So I, I am, I am duty bound to uh, your choices. So that we will be getting. Uh, I am going to uh, focus on getting some of our uh, supply quests done, so I can get that thirty percent discount before buying that beast. Cause yeah. That's going to be expensive. All right, sand pits, recharge station. Yeah, now that I have this, now that I have this, I can I can see exactly what's going on here. Um, anything? Yeah, see, light view is not really, not really a thing. Not really um, profitable. There's 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 not too many things to go going for it. You are silver. Silver bee is uh, sand pits. Oh, hi, turtle wise. Don't mind if I do. You probably have cheap gems at this point. It's just past the yellow. Oh, hey. Mysterious hands restored. The world is truly going to change now. Take this seed. It's something special for all your efforts. Amazing! Ask about the seeds. It's an old prophecy. When all six seeds grow again, I will, uh, I will come back to you, and you'll forget all of your pain. We'll be, build the root world anew. That sounds like a cataclysm, actually. <laughs> that sounds like a world-ending cataclysm, but I uh, will go with it. Uh, most of us have seeds and those fascinating tree samples from the past. Please, the god will come to the islands after those six trees grow again. Strange as it may sound, we've tried to grow the seeds and nothing happened. They neither grew nor decomposed. The duduk is something special. What if we can make these uh, seeds grow? Come back to us when you have all six. Okay. Um, and just give me your chance. Well, I'm glad I bumped into them anyway. I'm guessing these six seeds uh, compo uh, comprise the uh, pretty much the entirety of the uh, workshop, trade station, cheap sand, apple field. Yeah, we'll go here just for the recharge station anyway. <clears throat> I am scouting out legitimately for a. Uh, for, for a shipwright. Are we short on any people? For seven gold? We'll hire one person. Oh, well. Who really work with the mysterious hands restoration? This deserves a word. Uh, come visit us on Turtle Eyes when you can. Um, I already did that. Batteries got from the hands are very unusual. We might be able to use them to build new recharge stations. That's the real reward that I'm looking for. Being able to build my own recharge station? Now that's what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, right. No, nothing nothing of, of, of keen interest here. I mean, I could offload my sand for, for a, a, a profit here. If I really wanted to. Um, but no, I think I don't, I don't think I will. I'm, uh, I'm just going to drop it off at the brick place. All right, you are, oh, a super cheap and highly abandoned area. Um, let's see if this thing gives me any, uh, kind of like, Someone might want to claim it later. Oh, 
it. I'm gonna claim it later. Okay, um... I mean, it's a cheap recharge. I ain't gonna complain. But I guess we can't do anything with it until then. Alright, let's get to Iron B. I mean, that's a... That, that, that is the cheapest of the recharges, and we can offload our cheap gems. Oh wait, no, we can buy more gems. I'm getting my gem purchasing mixed up. Uh, yeah, your gems are still on the cheaper side. Um, no reason not to, to get as much wood as we can. Hmm, maybe I should have sold that stuff. Because we can only go up to a full stack of the wood, but that's okay. We can go up, we, we can do the full stack of wood. Oh, right, we can only fit five of you. Well, alright, hang on. Where's that, where's that guild hall? Is there a guild hall here? No. No. All right. But to say, like, I want to just donate goods, but no, we'll just get the five and we'll get the eight. We'll buy what we can here. Pains me that we cannot uh, buy the full allotment here. But you know what? We've got our things nearby. Uh, Castleham. Six flowers. Yeah, that's we, we gotta boost those numbers. Those are those are rookie numbers. How are we doing here for Cloud View? Fourteen. We gotta boost those numbers. Those are rookie numbers as well. Seashire. Okay. Okay, so we'll put you um, in storage. We'll take you on. Um, all of this glass can remain here for the time being. Because I'm not ready to run to the bazaar. Now, white view. White view. Let's see about uh, building a. Uh, let's see about building a recharge station in White View. We have room, right? Takes two batteries and two steel for a much lower price. That makes me happy. Uh, we do need two steel. Okay, um, yeah, we are running low on sand here, so let's deposit all the sand. Let's take on all of those bricks. Let's take on all of that stone. We only needed 20 stone for the lighthouse quest, yes? Yes. All right, let's bang that out then. Let's see, King's Hold is where we want to go. And then we can hit up the Majestic Carrot and then we can go down to there. Yeah, that makes the most sense to me. Although, yeah, you know what? I might I might keep the bricks here. If we're if we're gonna be traveling afar and we're not going to be immediately using our bricks, let us store our bricks. Um, and heck, we'll store our wood, too. Not that this place does anything with the wood, but we'll store it anyway. But all the stone is going to be useful, and so is uh, the gems for selling. Alright, King's Hold will catch the breeze for a little speed boost there. Okay, um, yeah, so, liquidate gems, we could acquire just a crap ton of sand, um, and just supply it accordingly, we really could, uh, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world either, but now nah, we're producing it, I'm cheap. No, 
we'll go for a little half recharge here. All right, we'll go back to the carrots, sing them the song, and bring them the tourist. That's why we have the, the thingy there. We're pretty, if I remember, if memory serves, we're pretty close to leveling up our Majestic Carrot uh, friendship levels here. Take a look at the Majestic Carrot. There we go. And let us sing. Red, blue, blue. Yellow, yellow, green, red. Green, blue, green, blue, blue. Green, blue, green, blue, blue. Woohoo! Longer songs, better rewards. Oh boy. Friendship Award. We've truly become friends. I love all the songs we sang together. I want to give you something significant in appreciation for our friendship. Oh, hey, one of the seeds. Amazing. Well, thank you. Um, wait, you're, you're a plant that just gave me your seed. Uh, never mind. I'm not going to think too hard about that. Onwards. Onwards. Uh, Castleville was the tourist, and Mist Haven is that. So, yeah. Yeah, let's, uh... I should've, I should've hit up the bazaar. I mean, we're in the blue, too. I should've brought all my glass and bottles and such. We could've made some bank. I mean, we're gonna be making a fair amount from this tourist delivery here. 400, uh, some odd, uh, coins. Not too shabby. Um... Yeah, I like I like take taking tourists into the majestic carrot because we're near the lighthouse and we're going to be visiting the lighthouse frequently anyway. All right, Mist Haven. All right, you little lighthouse. Boom. All right, what's up next on the docket? Bricks and wood. Okay, um, slightly harder. I think we need to ramp up our wood production because we got lots of things demanding wood. Um, those are ship upgrades, not new ships. But hey, we're making progress. Stone burr, stone deposits, that kind of makes sense. Um, we don't need to hit the, or the bank. It's too early to hit the, uh, ship workshop, trade guild. Oh yeah, we can, we can hit up South Kirk for uh, cheaper dyes and then dump them in King's Hold on our way back up. Yeah, I know, our labor costs are starting starting to get a little high. I mean, nothing unmanageable. We're making, we're still making bank. I am not afraid of going bankrupt here. But we might as well make money at every turn. Ooh, and cheap tea, too. Cheap dyes, cheap tea. Bring it on. All right, land peak is. I also do you do need to load up a little bit more on and place normal price gems. Yeah, but you don't have a recharge station, and I don't want to get too. Greendale um, has. Yeah, no, we'll just go to King's Hold. And then we'll find somewhere to dump the tea. All 
Okay, so we can offload you. You don't want the T. We already offloaded the gems from earlier. There we go. Develop the trade post. Recharge for full. Okay, let's... I think we want to... Ravenkirk. Yeah, we gotta bring back a tourist to Ravenkirk. Um, we got to... Um... How are you doing? You're still crank... Yeah, we gotta... We gotta um... The upgrade cost is 10 wood and... Oh, that's the Lumberjacks hut, though. The sawmill, I mean, we gotta upgrade the lumberjacks, but the sawmill is more of the same. So just more wood and more stone. And we have a crap ton of both in Whiteview. So let's crank up our our, um, our production here. Our lumber plank production thing. So we're gonna take plenty of stone. We're gonna take a full stack of bricks and uh, Full stack of wood. That should get us what we need. Alright, so we, um, we upgrade the Lumberjack's Hut to level 2, and we upgrade the Sawmill to level 2. Um, and that get, keeps the two lockstep uh, in, in with each other. I'm just going to do this to consolidate our, our, uh, our stuff here. Um, let's take you. Just in case we need that for something. Let's see what our flowers need to grow. Oh, hey, turtle wise. Come to daddy. And give me cheap gems. Every time we can, every, we, we've, I think we've gotten pretty much all of them here. Um, let's, yeah, let's go in here. I need to remind myself. Wait, no, no, no. I didn't want to go back to the turtle wise. Upgrade cost is sand. I needed the freaking sand. We need bricks, but we also need sand. Alright, so let's go to Ravenkirk. We can offload the T at least, and also drop off the quest. Charge. And yes, we will dump off that. Um, eh. We'll sell the we'll sell the three stone just to get it off our ship, just to free up the inventory slot. And yes, I know, my, the big ship that you guys all voted for will eliminate the whole inventory slot necessity. Um, I just haven't stumbled upon a place that sells one yet. So in due time, in due time. Alright, so we gotta pick up some, some heap and help of the sand. Uh, in order to upgrade that castle and... So that would be Seashire. We also do you have no you don't have iron on me. I need a I need an iron place at some point, which um, you got normal priced iron, but you also we also got uh, Castleworth, which is within decent shot of our little cluster of places here. Might actually be a good place to uh, build a uh, build a, uh, a uh, electricity thingy, Mahuzet. 
right then. Uh, let's get down to Seashire. Alright, we're gonna, we're, for the time being, we're gonna store the lumber. Um, glad those bottles stack so well. And yeah, this 20 sand is exactly as much sand as we need to upgrade the flower production. What did it uh, cost for this? Two, two of those. So yeah, we need, we need, uh, Now we can run all the way to Castleham, and then we can go back and do a big refill at Iron Bay. There we go. Level 2. Level 3 requires 30 sand, which we could probably... I mean, we have the bricks for it. Um, we just need to pick up a big pile of sand. Uh, let's take these 20 flowers. Um, since we're headed for Iron Bee anyway, we can we can uh, cash those in. And Cloudview should have well, they need 50 for that uh, for that supply quest. So we still need to cook for a little bit. Letter for us. We're connecting the world. Install mailboxes in Red Cloud. Install mailboxes in Sunfall. Install mailboxes at the Azure Edge. Report back to Iron Bee for a big fat reward. Let's see. Only available in the Ancient District, but I've received requests to install them in all other districts. Uh, for now, put at least two mailboxes in each district, starting with the Red Clouds. Install them at the Trade Guild. Ash gave her permission. Okay, do I need to, like, pick up them, or build them, or what? Okay, uh, so we buy more gems, and we sell all the flowers. Still losing money on the transaction, but not in a bad way. And we can we can snap up the 23 wood. All right, let's get let's get to uh, go to Seashire, but I guess we could go to Whiteview here. I don't wanna I don't wanna land head first into that uh, cloud. What's the sawmills upgrade cost? Thirty and fifteen. Oh we don't have any wood. So yeah, you know what, we're just gonna triangulate this. At some point, I gotta pick up all this glass and bottles and hit up the bazaar. Actually, I should do that right now. Look how close we are to it. If we can, if we can make it there before the end of the trading day, yeah, we can also liquidate all these gems. All right, so a full stack is fifty. Good to know. We'll take the uh, excess glass while we're at it. All right, let's see if we can book it to the uh, bazaar in one day. Because we want to cash in when there's a horde of visitors. All right, let's see what we got here. So the demand for glass actually isn't very good. Um, we're going to need to sell you cheap. Uh, demand for gems is nice and high. 250. 
And the demand for bottles is mercifully high. I am not liquidating my bricks. They are too much, too useful. I mean, I could. I could, because we're making more of them. Might as well. We're making them. This is an opportunity. Eighty-one seems to be the magic price for you. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, I wonder if you could sell the the batteries. I didn't even think of that. Making bank. We're making bank. Wow, we had a lot of leftovers. An alarming amount of leftovers. In fact, they left me with one gem. Huh. Well, that's slightly obnoxious, leaving me with one gem. South Kirk. Oh, yeah, let me remind myself what um, this place needs again. Oh, 10 and 10, uh, 10 brick, 30 wood. All right, you know what? We can, we, um, I think we've got 30 wood stored here. Yeah. No, well, not quite 30 wood, but we can pop up to Cloud here and, and pop that. Slightly worrisome that they didn't want to buy that many uh, of, uh, of our bottles here, but we also don't have any of the uh, um, any of the uh, perks related to um, the bazaar. I take you. We'll take you. And yeah, you're fine. Go up to cloud you and take a cloud to the face. We're going to burn one of our batteries getting to Iron Bee, aren't we? Um, yeah, let's get you there. Alright, so that's going to be enough for our next part of our lighthouse here. We'll spin by Iron Bee, but I have a feeling we're going to burn one of our batteries. But at least, say hey, it's better than a tow charge. I'll take that over a tow charge. All right, did you get more? No, you did not. New stock on blue. Dang, we just we must have just missed it. All right, fair enough. Recharge. All right, but we have what we need for the inn. Yes. 10 and 30. Yes, we do. Alright, well, you know what? Let's, uh, let's, let's go as the crow flies here to, um, this table here. Or rather, let's just carve a bit out of the, uh, of the unknowns here. Where are you? Mansion. Hmm. What are you? Iron deposits. And you are also iron deposits and stone deposits. Interesting. All right, next part. Rebuild lighthouse. Boom. Um. Oh, 25 stone and 25 glass. That's easy. That's that's actually kind of easy. I mean, it'll take us a little while to build up the 25 stone, but the 25 glass is... Yeah. We, we make more glass than we use in bottles anyway. 
that's not a problem. Mansions. The mansion's a curious one. Okay. Lock. Let's workshop. All right. Yeah. Let's. Let's. We got quests all over the freaking place. What is that? What is our quest over here? I'm gonna run to South Tree just to thread the needle between these storms and get caught anyway. Oh, mailbox installation. Well, hey, a new trade post. I'll take it. Oh, yeah, we do need that. I was wondering if we just got those for free, but of course not. Uh, oh my god, cheap gems, give. Cheap dyes, give. Um, not cheap iron, but we could... Alright, you know what? I need to buy that iron island nearby. But cheap gems, cheap uh, that, we'll take you. box installation in red clouds yeah this whole this whole area is ship workshop there's like yeah there's no ship right in Irondale hmm let's investigate Let's see if Irondale actually has an upgraded ship for us. Alright, there's the Caravel. This is the one that was uh, winning the poll early on. And I actually wouldn't have been... Uh, can't afford the Freda. That wasn't even on the poll. Don't even think about it, people. And there's the Carrick. It's right here in all its glory. 250 max energy, but it guzzles it. Um, 24 storage size. But look at these people on board here. This thing's nuts. Just crewing this, necessary crew size. But it's what you people voted for. Good. Googly moogly, that is a big ass ship. Please tell me there's people here. There is people here. I am not hiring 64 people. Although it would make more sense just to hire... Alright, fine. We'll fill up. Let's just depopulate the town. Um... Let's see. Woods cheap. Wheat's cheap. And we can just grab whatever is cheap whenever we want, because we've got like 11 billion cargo slots. Alright, folks. We, we have the Gargantu ship. I hope you're happy. I hope you're happy. Uh, let's get the King's Hold so we can liquidate some of this, get some, have our cash recover itself a little bit. And ponder how in the world I'm going to actually make use of all this cargo space that you have saddled me with. Um, so yeah. GM there and there. And yeah, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna grab all of this, uh, grab all that sand. 
Because darn it. Now, granted, I don't think we need to worry about uh, that. And also, I do. Uh, I, I now I, I I'm reminded that my skills are uh, knocking down the ship's uh, fuel use uh, down to 1.2 instead of the um, slated 1.5. So it's 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 not as bad as it looks, but still, this is this is a huge honking ship right here. Um, right then. White view. Yeah, let's go for it. Um, alright, as far as, uh, what's our, what's our poll gonna be? Um, I think, I think the poll's gonna be, once again, our, our focus. Uh, do we focus on the mailboxes? Do we focus on the lighthouse? Um, or what other outstanding quests do I have? Do we focus on the uh, resource um, uh, delivery for Iron Bee? Because I'm going to tell you right now, I might upgrade from the Carrick to the RMB anyway, but I'm not going to do that until I get that 30% discount. Uh, so I will at least tour around with the, um, the, the Carrick for a while. Maybe it'll grow on me. Maybe it will grow on me. Uh, that is a distinct possibility. Um... But I do think it also involves us buying this Iron Island Castle worth here. So actually, yeah, before we finish up here, let's let's get some let's get our commerce on. Um, so let's get to White View. We also need to uh, hit up the World Market and get some shiny shiny modules for this thing. Because we've got seven module slots now. So, to say the least, we can get some goodies here. Oh, we're not demolishing anything. What are you talking about, Willis? Okay. Um, yeah, we'll take more bricks. Uh, yes, you may have more sand. We need what? Um, we can also upgrade our flowers. We will take the stone. We have an even amount of sand. Actually, let's 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 go look to our flowers. Upgrade costs twelve and thirty. Hmm. My greed is is tickling my fancy here. We could also let's add uh, get our supercharge our water uh, thing with a uh, water module and a visit to the water island as one of the options here. So we, do, we only need 30 um, of our sand, so we will dump the rest in here for brick making. Seems weird component for that sand, but eh, whatever. And we'll pick up our, uh, our goodies here. Upgrade to level three. All right, level four is more sand and uh, more bricks. But again, still not bad, especially if I can pick up a crap ton of cheap sand from uh, Kingsford. Yeah, just give me all the flowers. All the flowers, please. Now, is somebody around here wanting to buy wheat for expensive Price cheap. Actually, sand is cheap up here. And actually, you've got a ship workshop. Let's uh, let's visit you. No oh, wait, you need sixteen, and we've got ten. Okay, so not quite enough of those. But yeah, let's go to Brad Crag for the very first time because we can do some ship upgrades. Now these are these are more mundane ones, but not all of them are, are bad. So we've got we, we carried over our um, our install here. I want this water barrel. Um, I want this crane so we can get those uh, boxes uh, when we pass by them. And then I think the rest of the slots I'm going to save for for shiny things on um, from the world market. 
What's your cost? Ew, God, look at those. Look at those. I, I'm gonna. I'm definitely saving the tank for Iron Bee here. Um. Wait, sand is expensive. I thought it said it was cheap. You lied to me, game. I must have misread it. That's all right. But hey, I got my upgrade, so I'm happy. Speaking of Iron Bee, and actually speaking of Cloud View, so 34. I will gas up at Iron Bee because I mean it is the absolute cheapest place to up for, to gas up. There is a shipwreck on one of the islands to the southwest. Try looking for survivors as soon as possible. Oh my. Yeah, 153 gold. And that's a full tank. Yay, Iron Bee cheap gas. Uh, yeah. So, sheep on you, and let us liquidate the flowers, and um, liquidate the stone. Well, actually, not all of the stone. We'll keep some of the stone. We'll buy some... Actually, let's not, not liquidate any of the stone, because we can do a lot of upgrading to our Iron Island with the stone. And the extra wood will help out as well. All right, now, before we end the episode, let us make our way to Castlewood. And actually, here, we'll try out our new shiny crane. It just has random goods just sitting in there. Slightly underpriced. Slightly underpriced. Really, Stoneshire? You're kind of undermining the whole purpose for me buying an iron island. <laughs> if you're going to just sell super-duper cheap iron... But you only have five of it. I will buy this, however. And yeah, we don't have to look at the gas tank at all uh, until we're good and ready. All right, let Castle Worth. A uh, thousand bucks, sure. All right, let's get our storage on. Let's get our mining deposit. Oh, we need planks and bricks. And here I thought we'd be able to make do with just base resources. Nope. We can build a, f an, a forge really easily. I know we already have a forge elsewhere, but... Um, this will turn the iron into... This will turn it into that locally. And, yeah, we could use the ingots. And then this will be a nice recharge station in the middle of nowhere here. Alright, we'll go for a forge, even before we have the iron here. And here, we'll send all the necessary workers, because we have a million crew. And yeah, there, you can start working on that. Now what else does the forge do? Actually, the forge... Forge makes glass. Yeah, we don't need that. Alright, let's get our other stuff. Actually, we'll do that in the next episode. We'll actually build this proper... Um, and get it cooking. So if you guys like this episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment, good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback's always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya!